anyone who's ever been to Fanfare, uh, the CMA Music Festival, understands that country music fans come in different shapes, sizes, and nationalities. Heck, this past year I watched a group of Mongolian medics stand in line to watch Big and Rich sing Save a Horse, Ride a Cowboy. Go figure. But just like country music fans come in different packages, so do a lot of the new country music artists coming up. In this Cyber Country Minute, you'll meet an award-winning country music artist that I caught up with at 12th and Porter. Even though you may have not heard of her, if she keeps up her to current pace on this side of the Atlantic, you soon will. I'm Lucy Diamond, all the way from the UK. I'm here, I've had a really busy couple of months um, that have really got me stacked out. I've been doing some co-writing in the daytime um, with some really great writers, people like Joey Scott, who's written hits for Shania Twain, and uh, she had another one with Colin Ray's um, song, Not That Different, and I've been doing shows at night, I've been doing some acoustic shows, and I've just done a really big showcase, and I've had some good fun, which I'm sure you lot are going to see some of it later. <laughs> Do you know what, for me, years ago, um, when I was a little girl, um, the, the most inspiring thing in the charts when I was younger was, um, I had this joke on my set, it was ice, ice, baby, vanilla ice, you know, that was the most inspiring I got. And um, I came home from school one day to hear a certain young lady called Dolly Parton, um, she was playing on the radio. Um, for the first time ever, I'd, um, I'd actually got emotionally involved in a song, and it was, it was kind of weird for me, because it made me get involved and want to get down to the end of the song and um, to find out what the story was and I didn't realize at the time that these songs that you know you could actually have an emotional attachment to and for me country music is the only genre of music for me where you can actually get the uh, emotional attachment to a song and you can tell a story and uh, that's why I love it and uh, that's why I love writing it and I love singing it yeah do you, do you know what for me you just you just have to listen to a variety of different music it's no good listening to um, just um, pop music so you need to listen to your blues and your jazz and you'll find that in the stuff that I do you've got blues and jazz and it's country blues country soul which is kind of I've been labeled at the moment and I think you need to listen to as much people as you can and then come to somewhere like Nashville and discover there's a whole world of artists you didn't know existed because I'd never get to the UK. Um, and it's just kind of come from there. And uh, I don't know where, it, where it's come from, but it came from somewhere. <laughs> oh, do you know what, for me, I love being able to see the audience. I love being able to look at them and sing to them and point them out, and then they smile back. And uh, I don't like it when I can't see anything and it's all black. And uh, I love it when I can actually make eye contact with people and that gives me a buzz on stage. And of course, playing around with the musicians and having some fun. I've got a manic, I've got another two weeks here in Nashville. And then um, I've got, I'm going to Europe to do some uh, shows and promotion. And then I'm going to South Africa uh, for Christmas, and that should be fun. I've got some shows over there, some charity stuff I'm doing. I'm really looking forward to that. And next year, um, it's going to be back to here. Uh, I'm, I'm definitely back in Nashville in June for the... Um, I've just been asked to host the Global Artist Showcase, which is fantastic. So I'm doing that in June. But uh, who knows? It's just going mad. and. I've just got a diary that's set out for me and I just turn up. <laughs> Do you know, if they listen to me first and they kind of, they kind of like the stuff, um, because I, I do sing, this may sound kind of twee, but I do sing from the heart. I love everything I sing and I believe in everything I sing. And that comes across on stage. So if you hear, you hear the record and you like it, you're going to love the live set and the stage show even better because uh, I like to have a bit of fun and rock out. So I'm Lucy Diamond. Come see me live. You'll have a good time. Thanks. I'm, again. <laughs> I'm Lucy Diamond and there's a big truck just gone past. There you go. I'm Lucy Diamond. Come see me live without the truck. <laughs>